Rebecca by Daphne du Maurier is one of my favorite novels and one of the best written of all time. It was written in 1938 and is set in a creepy English countryside mansion, a perfect location to scare and delight readers. The novel works on a basic level as a mystery and on an allegorical level as a case for feminism. Mysteries often adapt well to films. Murder on the Orient Express and The Third Man are great adaptations of novels and also great films in their own right. Given the novel's setting and dual interpretations, it should be perfect for a film adaptation. Alfred Hitchcock creates amazing sets for the film, and there's a lot to love from the performances of Laurence Olivier and Joan Fontaine. However, there's a problem. Rebecca uses a literary device where the main character is unnamed and lacks description. This emphasizes Rebecca's suffocating presence in Manderley and the unnamed character's lack of identity in comparison. Identity, in general, is a big theme in the novel, and how we, the audience, judge people based on the information present 